welcome back to the table, which can only mean one thing. Today we are crafting and DIYing. And we're also joined by our special guest, Naomi. Me. Her, <laughs> who has been in quite a few of these. As you know, we are preparing for... What are we preparing for? My birthday party. Your birthday party. And how old are you? Nine. Nine years old. And what is the theme? Harry Potter. Harry Potter. As you know, we are big Harry Potter fans in this house. So all this month we are doing Harry Potter crafts and DIYs. We've been doing so many DIYs lately. Maybe I need to start a segment where every once in a while I make videos that are crafting with K. What do you think? I think I like it. You like it? Okay, maybe we'll start a crafting with K segment. If you have not seen me before, if you have not watched our videos before, I'm Kay, this is Naomi, and on this channel we talk about mom life, nerd life, and living in a small town. Currently we're on a nerd life kick because we're preparing for the aforementioned birthday for this one and doing all things Harry Potter. We will be back to mom life and small time life. Small time? <laughs> we'll be back to mom life and small town living very shortly. So if that's something you're interested in, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. So a couple weeks ago we made DIY Harry Potter flying keys. We made a mobile. It's really cool. We really like it. It's hanging in our living room until the birthday party. It's really neat. Um, you can check out that video right there above Naomi's head. Right there. It'll, it'll, it'll be up here. Not quite above here. It, up here. There. Today we are going to be making mini Hogwarts portraits and also the Hufflepuff cup. Um, Helga Hufflepuff's cup because this one here is a Hufflepuff and we are also potentially doing something fun with Horcruxes at her birthday party. No spoilers. So Naomi, why don't you take it away first and tell us about the Harry Potter portraits. Um, well this is how we did it. We took some printables that we found on Google. We got, um, the pink lady the Hogwarts House Founders, Sleeping Dumbledore, funny Lego picture of Gilderoy Lockhart, and we even snuck in a picture of Gandalf because he's an epic wizard. Then we traced them onto an empty cereal box and cut them out in frames. Then we took some pasta we had in, at our house. We glued them on the frames in fancy designs. Then we painted them and used double stick tape to tape the, the, the paintings onto the cardboard. And they are super cute and they look so much like real paintings. And I'm really happy with how they turned out. Next, we're gonna show you how we made the Hufflepuff cup with just a few easy to find supplies from the dollar store. The Hufflepuff cup was actually pretty simple. It just took some time. I found this trophy in the party section of the dollar store. I'm simply going to glue on this Hufflepuff crest like so. Then we used hot glue to outline around the crest and the badger inside. I also decided last minute to add an H down here at the bottom for dear Helga. So after the glue had a chance to dry, I got out my trusty egg carton palette and my spun gold paint and I painted it. This is how it looked after one coat of paint. And here is the finished product. It took three coats of gold paint. I then used black paint and dry brushed parts of it to give it some shading and dimension. It's not perfect, but I'm pretty happy with it. And after all, it's not my opinion, but Naomi's opinion that matters. So Naomi, what do you think? I really like it. 
like it. I like how the black paint gives it dimension and like shading. Happy to hear it. So we are really thrilled with how these came out. They're just adorable and I can't wait to display them at the birthday party. So stay tuned to see all of the fun DIYs and crafts that we've put together out on display for her birthday in a couple of weeks. Again, let us know what you thought in the comments down below. Let us know which portrait you like the best. My favorite portrait that mommy made, she made this really awesome Dumbledore and I really like Helga and I like Rowena Ravenclaw and Salazar Slytherin. Oh, and I like my, uh, I'm not trying to do all of mine, but <laughs> I really like my, my Gandalf. Your Gandalf <laughs> is fun. <laughs> for those of you who don't know what the in-joke is about Gandalf is that, for one, he's probably the most epic wizard of all time. Second of all, there is a thought that you can spot him in the part that's at Hogwarts. I've Maybe. never seen this officially I've, confirmed. I've We've checked, that. but... Um, we've never seen it officially confirmed, but we've decided to add Gandalf as a fun little in-joke just to make us giggle. Who doesn't love Gandalf? <laughs> also, let us know again, if you haven't yet before, what your Hogwarts house is down below. Are you a Harry Potter fan? We hope you are for these next few videos. If not, like I say, we'll be back to regularly scheduled programming very soon. I think that's all we have for today. We'll see you next week with more exciting DIYs.